Sound check. Testing, testing. One, two, three. Hey team, this is Luke from Crusader Machining. We're back for another video. A lot of the content I make, I try to teach and this and that, blah, blah, blah. But life is worth living. Today we're going to do something a little different and have fun. This is not the bar. This is the bar. One and three quarter round, 12, 15 steel. We are going to see how hot we can get an insert. Surface footage per minute. SFM is what we program in. 1215, usually I like to run my SFM between 500 on the low end up to 800. The faster you run your SFM, the more heat you generate. We're gonna crank this baby up with a WNMG 432 and see how hot we can get the insert. Let's see if we can get this son of a gun glowing red. We're about to start right now. Like, subscribe, share, blah, blah, blah. Let's get started. So our idea didn't work yet to generate this heat to blow up the insert, but we got some gnarly looking chips. And take a look at this wicked bird's nest right here. Whoa, what a beauty. Let's try again. So the first two, the first two trials, as you can see, did not work. Uh, we did not, we got a lot of chip breakage. I mean, we were really cooking and cruising but it didn't work, did not get it hot enough. So now we're gonna go back to basics. I'm gonna bring in some 17.4 stainless, same thing, WNMG 432 on 17.4 stainless, and we're gonna rip it at about a thousand surface footage per minute, kick those parameters into high gear, and let's see what we can do. Let's do this. Hey team, as you can see, that insert cooked. Figuratively and literally. That edge is gone. And I do stuff like this to test tools. I test them a lot. I test inserts that people give me to try, but I also test the inserts that we have in house. I test different tool paths, different depths of cut, different surface footage, blah, blah, and a resounding blah. I enjoy doing it. It's fun. And it gives me a little bit more knowledge versus just running the same thing over and over. Now I know I can really push those tools. In the first two sections of video before we did round three, I was pushing that 1215 up to 1200 surface feet, 1300 surface feet. I was feeding anywhere from 5,000 up to 15,000. Everything I gave it, there was no problem whatsoever. So I'm trying to get this insert to burn hot, basically trying to get it to fail. Everything I threw at it, it wouldn't fail. And it was a medium grade insert, nothing fancy, but it was fun and I learned something. What got it in the end to burn up like that, 17.4 stainless, I don't know what condition, I don't know if it was heat treated or annealed or whatever. 17.4 stainless and I really had to push that tool surface footage. I was upwards around 1200 SFM. Now for the people out there that know what it means, you know what it means. If you don't know what it means, in the world of machining, we calculate RPM by SFM. 
surface footage per minute. That's how we calculate it. So you could say, oh, I'm running at 1,000 RPM, but a machine is to wonder, what surface footage is that? Especially if you're fighting a tool. Bad tool life, well, especially bad tool life, if something's burning up, they're gonna say to you, what surface footage are you running at? That's when you calculate the surface footage from the RPM. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Something fun, little educational, educational for me, but hopefully you guys like seeing that insert completely obliterate itself. I had fun, I liked it. What do you think? Comment down below. Once again, this is Luke with Crusader Machining, signing out. Find me at Tic Tac, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, at Crusader Machining. Leave a like, leave a comment. What did you think? You ever done that? How many inserts have you blown up? Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time.